Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel today. I am joined with my younger sister, Emily, and my older sister, Sarah. I'll have their channels linked down below, but I'm sure you guys already know who they are. Today we're doing something rather exciting. We are going to be trying some great British treats, some British candies. Do you want to scoot in? I can scoot over so you can fit <laughs> a little more. This is kind of exciting, like trying British treats because Emily goes to college in London. Have you tried any of these treats? Do you? One. One? Okay. I'm so excited. And it's like my favorite, so. Mm. Our dad got us this box of British treats, so. Shout out to our dad if you're watching this. Hey, dad. Yeah. I'm very excited to try these, and I thought this would be a great video, so. I'm so excited. Us Americans is, are trying some British treats. What are you saying? Um, the thing is, like, if we open all of them, we're gonna have to finish all of them today so they don't go stale. The box comes with six candies. They're like all candy bars. I think that's they seven. all seem one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven candy bars. <laughs> they all look good, so I'm very excited. All right, you can choose the first one. I'll go. All right. Curly Whirly. So our first candy is a Curly Whirly. The thing about their candy is like how here it's all like Hershey's chocolate, but there it's all Cadbury. Okay, so this is milk chocolate with a caramel center, but it's like, where's the center? Because <laughs> there's cutouts. That's so cool. Okay. Between the layers. Should we yeah, like I guess split it's just caramel three? inside. Yeah, I'll split it into three. Maybe uneven lettuce. Oh, it, it actually focused. Oh, it's Ooh, like soft. Oh, it's like, it's like bendy. Oh. bendy. Oh, so I'm sure it's oh, like just it's caramel. caramel. This looks like it'll break my tooth. Oh, cheers. Cheers. It's like a milk done milk stick. Milk <laughs> It's literally like a milk done. It like sticks to the back tooth. You know, and it doesn't mm -hmm. come off. Cause you always have, like you never run out. It's always in your teeth. Like even when you finish the box, like you're, you're gonna have more caramel. Just Save some on. for later. <laughs> so basically if you're an American, this is a milk dud stick. <laughs> Should we do like ratings? Mm, mm -hmm. Seven. Seven. 6.5. The reason I give it a 6.5 is cause I would like there to be a little more chocolate flavor. It's like very caramel heavy, you know? Yeah. But milk dots are the same way. All right, so candy number two, we have a double decker, also from Cadbury. Are these all Cadbury? Yeah, every oh, single, cool. they're all Cadbury. So that's like if we were to do an American box and do like Reese's, Kit Kat, Her, yeah. like all, yeah. Those are I'm all trying to see if cheese. there's like a description. Okay, nougat top and crispy bottom in Cadbury milk chocolate. It's chunky. So the little- oh. oh! Did you just cut your finger? That's a really good question. This is the inside. Cheers! Cheers. Mmm. It's like, um... The nougat's like soft. It's like a marshmallow almost. But this is almost mm -hmm. like marshmallowy. It's like mm -hmm. almost solid. Like it bounces, like it's- I think it would be better if it was just the marshmallow and the chocolate. For me, the crunchies remind me of cereal and I don't like cereal, but I, that means I'm just, ignore me. So what's your rating? Five out of 10, cause I don't like crunchies. Mm. I'd give it an eight. I'd give it a seven again, one more time. All right, so our next one is the crunchy. And so this, is my this fave. yeah, this is the one Emily's had before. It's you said it's honey, honeycomb, golden honeycomb wrapped in Cadbury milk chocolate. I want to say I've had this before. When did you I have it for the first time? time? Okay, so like that's me. what the inside looks like. As you can see, it's a it's a honeycomb. It's it's almost like a butterfinger that's consistency. That's what I was thinking, but butterfinger is dried peanut butter. It's just like a dried it. It's like a dried thing in the middle wrapped in chocolate. <laughs> Cheers. Oh. Good. It's almost like burnt tasting. Hmm. I love that. All right, so what would you rate that? The honeycomb? Yeah. I would give it an eight out of 10. 10 out of 10. I'd give it an eight, yeah. So far, <laughs> so far it's been my favorite one. Let's see. Are those raisins I see. Yeah, should we do that next? Okay. Yeah. So the next one is a picnic. So this is- That's a cute name. This is a chewy, crunchy, fruity feast covered in Cadbury milk chocolate. Sounds like it's like fruit cake covered in chocolate. Like yeah. Do you guys like raisins? I don't mind do them. Like I would never go out of my way to eat a raisin though. 
I like them in trail mix. Yeah, like that's where I'll eat it with like an M and M. Same. Cheers. Oh, I like this. But trail mix. Oh yeah, it's like the trail it's like mix bars it's that like we buy. It's like chocolate covered trail mix. I would eat this as like after a workout, like a protein bar. Yeah, it's just kind of protein <laughs> bar-y. It's mm -hmm. good. Because the nuts and raisins make it feel healthy. Honestly, this is a 10 for me. This is my new favorite. That's good. I really like this. Uh -huh. It reminds me of those Nature's Valley like bars that have the nuts mm -hmm. fruit and fruit nut and the chocolate. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's good. I can't believe this is my favorite. The raisins were like scary. Yeah, I was good. afraid this would be like the scary one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I give it a 10. I give it a 10. And it even has cereal crunchies and I give it a 10. I give it a nine. Mm -hmm. All right, next is just a plain Cadbury dairy milk chocolate with caramel. So a milk chocolate I wonder how it's caramel. different from the other Cadbury stick. It's like- This is like, like a, like you, um, yeah. So as you can it's see, like, I kind of like this. It's similar to like a Hershey's bar where you can like cut, like snap yeah. off like a little piece. So, so this will, Sarah loves caramel. I do be loving it. If I remember correctly, these are very good. I would love to have this with like a coffee in the mm -hmm. afternoon, you know, a little nibble of chocolate. Yeah. Okay, cheers. Cheers. Ooh, ooh. It's classic, it's caramel and chocolate. I like, it's definitely a lot less sweet than like, um, what's it, like a Ghirardelli one? The caramel is different, like I'm comparing this to a Rolo, because that's essentially mm -hmm. what it is, but like this caramel tastes a little different. Even the pick on the front makes it look like a Rolo. Mm -hmm. This caramel is like more rich. Mm -hmm. I feel like a little, like I've eaten a lot. I've eaten a lot of chocolate. <laughs> I've eaten chocolate. It's hitting me, yeah. Emily should just dissolve this all in her coffee. What do you rate that? I give mm. that like a seven and a half, eight. I would give it a eight out of 10. I liked it. Okay, so next is a star bar. This is a chewy cosmos of peanuts and caramel. So I think dad said this is similar to like payday. a payday. But covered in chocolate, of course. You know what's kind of interesting? I don't know if this is true or not, but you know how all of these have been kind of the same color scheme? They have like the purple and yellow. Mm -hmm. Mm. Like whenever, I feel like if you go to like a Sheets or a gas station to get chocolate, there's like different colors everywhere. Like everything's a different color. But is it like when you go to the store there? Maybe that's just like the Cadbury color. Oh, okay. So I'll show you this. Actually, this is more, it almost just looks like peanut butter. Cheers. 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 Mm, mm, mm. It's like fudgy, like peanut butter mm -hmm. fudge. That consistency is like, oh. <laughs> is like mm -hmm. peanut butter fudge. Mm -hmm. It's a little bland in the mm -hmm. peanut butter depart department. I think I'd give that like a six. Same. I give it a six too. Like I'd eat though. it, but. Our last one, we have just a plain Cadbury dairy milk, a milk chocolate bar. So this is my jam. Emily and I, when quarantine started, we would split a Hershey's bar almost every single night. I guess this is like a true test of like the difference between like Cadbury, just plain milk with Hershey's. We have mm. a Reese's cup. So this is like the same as that caramel one where you could like split it into pieces. So cheers, last one. Wait, there's that's the last one? Yeah, I'm gonna try to like compare it to like a Hershey's kiss or something. It's, it's not definitely, as sweet. yeah, it's definitely a lot less sweet. I was Usually when I eat a Hershey's bar or Hershey's Kiss, I have that like stinging in the back of my throat from the sweetness, you know what I mean? Or probably like the chemicals they put in it. Maybe. <coughs> oh. I like this chocolate. Or I think I like this better than a Hershey Kiss. And like, I personally love dark chocolate, so I like that this isn't super sweet. I like it. I like it better than like Hershey's. <laughs> Me I too. I agree. I feel like I can eat a lot of this. Mm -hmm. All right, those were all seven British Candies. I guess they were all chocolate candies. I wish we got some like cool like fruity ones or something. But... Yeah, Emily, what are some like, do they have Sour Patch Kids? They have like peach rings. In conclusion, I I like, I liked all of them. I, yeah, same. I will say I like the chocolate on all of them a lot better than like the chocolate on American candies. Mm -hmm. Which one was your favorite? Honestly, I can't believe it, but the one with picnic. raisins, the picnic. Yeah, the picnic was so my good. favorite. And the honeycomb, that's Emily's favorite. Yeah. The honeycomb. Those two are my favorite. Um, which one was your least favorite? I think the nougat crunchy. I think, I think the, the, the star bar yeah. was my least favorite. Is that the peanut butter one you just Yeah, had? that one, the double, oh gosh, we're making a mess. I think it's called the double, yeah, the double decker was my second least favorite. And then the milk chocolate. 
And then the caramel and the crunchy was my second favorite. I think I'm like missing one. And then the picnic was my like, most favorite, but honestly, they're all good. When Emily comes back for in the summer, you need to bring us mm -hmm. more things to try. This is the aftermath, all of the mess that we've made. There's a lot we have to, thank you. There's mm -hmm. a lot we have to clean up. All right, that was this video. Um, this video was so fun to make. Trying British candies was very fun. And again, I'll have both Emily and Sarah's channel in the description below. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you all in another video. Bye. Bye. I got chocolate on my fingers.